Hey there, I'm David Perry from OpenFab PDX. Typically, I would be playing for you a 3D printed violin, but today we're gonna do some bridge testing on my wooden acoustic. I'm gonna replace this professionally cut wooden bridge with a few 3D printed options. Let's see how they sound. Meet the bridges. Bridge one is a wooden bridge professionally cut with one to two millimeter higher action than the other bridges. Bridge two is a classic shape 3D printed bridge. Bridge three is modified. I've cored out a large portion of the center of that bridge. Bridge four is a super efficient design which comes to us from Don Corson in Switzerland. I have modified his design to fit my instruments a bit better. Finally, bridge five is ultra efficient. I'm using generative design, which is an algorithmic method to make a super efficient form to support the strings. These printed bridges are all made with Protopasta's HTPLA CF. That's a high temperature PLA with carbon fiber in it. And then they are annealed in the oven uh, so that they can become semi-crystalline and resist high temperatures. First, we're gonna hear some quick audio samples from each bridge so you can get a sense of them. Then we'll go more in depth. Okay, now you have a sense of what we're working with. So from here on out, I'm gonna play each bridge and talk about it a little bit. And I'll mark in YouTube uh, the, where each bridge is so that you can jump back and forth to hear them side by side. First, the wooden bridge. This 3D printed bridge is actually an older design of mine. You'll notice it has more material and it's got more of a classic wooden bridge shape. Uh, and I find that it has a darker, mellower, a little bit more closed tone, a little less volume. That's on my 3D printed instruments. Let's see how it sounds on this wooden instrument. Here we have my basic 3D printed bridge offering. Uh, what I like about this bridge, I've removed a lot of material, which helps to open up the sound and maximize the volume given the less stiff material. But I still have kept some of the features needed for a, a wing insert style pickup. Let's hear how it sounds. This bridge comes to me from Don Corson in Switzerland. He designed this bridge for his 3D printed instruments, and I have adjusted it somewhat for mine. I've made it a bit thicker, a bit stronger, and changed the height and string spacing a little bit. This bridge is super minimal. It doesn't have the wing features you might see on a traditional bridge, and it just uses a bare minimum of material. Let's see how it sounds.
This last 3D printed bridge, it's based on Don's design. However, I used a computer algorithm to generate a solution. So I used Don's bridge as the starting shape, and then the algorithm developed a highly efficient uh, way to put down material to support the loads from the strings. Using Don's design, we're able to keep some of the important resonances of the bridge, but again, super low mass and very efficient structure for holding that tension. So I'll have to go through the audio to see which one I like best, which I think sounds the best, which of course in violin acoustics, which one someone thinks is the best is highly open to interpretation. So let me know what you think. I'd love to hear in the comments if you thought one sounded better, worse, or if you heard different tonal characteristics, I'd love to hear what you hear. You can follow me on Instagram at openfabpdx and check out my website, openfabpdx.com. Thank you.